What up guys, it's Mike. It's Dan. Let's talk about body shaming. Let's talk about that. So there's a model. Yeah. Um, she, she went to a gym, she yep. went to the gym, yep. and then she Snapchatted a picture of someone else in the locker room. In the locker room who was nude, mm -hmm. okay? And uh, she wrote, I see this, now you can't unsee this. Which is one of the meanest things someone can do. Okay, the person she took a photo of was, she thought this girl was overweight. First right. of all, she wasn't even she overweight. She wasn't even that overweight, no. Okay, let, let's, let's get that out of the way. Second of all, even if she was overweight and this model did that, that's the one of the worst things. That's horrible. Look, we talk a lot about bullying, cyberbullying, because that's the new thing nowadays. Because there are so many social media platforms out there. Like before, if you want to bully someone, okay, you bully someone in maybe person. In person, maybe like ten people see it, twenty people see it at yep. the most. You know, like uh, you can bully someone in front of a school. I don't know. Yeah. yeah. But now millions of people can see this. This is unbelievable. Like. This first of all, the common sense of this model is got to be zero. Okay, you you're a mo this is and it's the worst kind too. It's like you're shaming first of all women on their body image, which is already like already come on like we struggle with this for so long as a society, not just in America, everywhere where women they're always being made to be self conscious about their body, always. Yes, and, and that's one of the things you know like makes me so mad. There's so many women that I know who are beautiful, yet they think that they're not beautiful. And right. I hate that. And you know, this is where it comes from. This is one yeah. of the things where it comes it from. Just, it just blows my mind that somebody, okay, you're a model, all right, we get it. You're, you're good looking, all right? You're good looking, you got a great body, whatever. You're, you're the 1%, okay? Mm -hmm. Most people look normal, right. all right? So what gives you the right, what gives you the right like to, to this is, okay, you're in a profession of, I feel like, privilege. Right. Okay, you, you were born a certain way, you look a certain way, great. That's your job, it's great, that, good for you. But to make some people feel bad because you don't feel like they look like you right. or look to up to your standard, it's just asinine. And it's just ridiculous because like you said, she's a professional model. Hello, you get paid to do this. You So you should, you get paid. Other people don't get paid. So you spend more time, you have better, you know, diet coaches, whatever. You know, like that's like a that's like Michael Jordan, like, yo, Mike, you're not good at basketball. Like, yeah. Are you like me, dude. Seriously, one thing I hate in this world is uh, people judging for someone for for things they cannot control. It's yeah. like when you hear about stories like a rich guy on a plane, so like, that rich guy was like a couple months ago on a plane, he was like, Hey, I make like uh, I make three million a month. Well, what do you make? Or the, the guy on a bus in, in Taiwan, the, the, like last week, he was right. telling the bus driver, like, look at this Armani suit. Yo, just because you have money, just because you're perceived to be good looking, don't give you the right to judge other people. Right. And so she issued an apology. Well, at, no, yeah. this, this, I agree. Okay, first of all, I think she issued the apology after she got slammed. Of course she did. So. You're, are you really sorry? Are you really sorry? Yo, if you, I, I feel like this person, because here's the thing, all right. Um, she sees this person. Yeah. And first of all, she, she thought it. She thought it, yep. And secondly, she had the audacity <laughs> to throw it up on social media. I mean, like, that's the audacity. Effort. Because when you're, when you're putting something on social media, yeah. right, you're, you're literally thinking in your head, you're like, okay, people are gonna like this. Yeah. Oh, right? oh, you don't oh. think like people are gonna hate on this. And she, she put it on Snapchat. She th probably thought that it's Snapchat. It's not forever. Well, no, everything is forever these days. That's Even what I'm saying. Snapchat, Periscope, whatever. But the the thought process in her head was that my followers yeah. would think this is funny, right? Right. This, that's a joke to her. Yeah. Yo, that's not a joke. No, that's not. You a joke. can't go around and slam people <sighs> for the way they look, for how much money they make. It just doesn't work like that. Yeah. I'm pretty shocked. I'm pretty shocked actually, because um, you don't you don't see this happen that often, like blatant body shaming like this. From she's not like a celeb celeb, but you know she's kind of famous a little bit. But you know what I mean? Like you don't see this that often. So I'm really it's, shocked. It's that just, I just this. feel like it's, it's first of all it's bad judgment on her part, mm -hmm. and secondly I don't I don't buy that apology. Yeah, I, I don't buy it. I don't buy it. At it's all. really something. That is just like yeah, all right, I'll, I'll say I'm sorry, and then and then hopefully smooth this over. But I don't. I mean, I don't buy it. I mean, can you imagine like someone, was, like you said, she's not even that famous. Right. Can you imagine if someone like Leo DiCaprio came out and was like, yeah. "Hey, I saw this 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 chubby guy at the gym. Look at look at him. Look, look at this. Yo, his career's over. <laughs> like this person is just I'm like, like I don't even understand you. 
no, I don't think anybody understands this. Like, this perplexes me. I'm just like, how? Like, I'm really at a loss for words. I feel like people in the positions of, uh, like, uh, that has a career based on basically Looks. other people. Yes. Uh, you know, YouTubers, whatever, yeah. like, uh, movie stars, TV stars, yeah. models, celebrities, or, uh, you know, celebrities in general. Yeah. Be humble about it oh, because right. these are the people that are paying your bills. These are the people who are like, who are supporting you so you can have a career, yeah. and so you can have your beauty routine. Especially, I think especially to models, um, they kind of have a response, more of a responsibility because they are directly representing this, right? Right. Directly representing this. You guys should be setting good examples for young girls. You should not be shaming other people, you know? Like, how would you like it if you, somebody shamed your kid like that, you know what I mean? Like you said, people that we know all the time, they feel like everyone's self-conscious. I was just yeah. reading, we were going through the news today, I was reading about a Chinese, uh, a Taiwanese, or it's a Thai, I think a Taiwanese vlogger, yeah. and she's a beauty vlogger, and yep. she's gorgeous. Yep. She's a model, I think she's a model, and even even her, she's like talking about how she's like self-conscious about Insecure, the, way, the way she feels. Everything. Look, everybody is self-conscious about, about, about something, all right? right? Everybody, even right. even this this girl, I'm sure she's self conscious about something. Yeah. Okay. But is it right? What gives you the right to make fun of someone for that, or right. highlight something, uh, or highlight an insecurity that they're trying to get over? Unbelievable. I mean, I just can't imagine. She must have. This model must have felt, like you said, at some point in her life, insecure about her looks. Right. Right. For her to, at the moment she's doing this, that 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 thought never crossed her mind. Like, oh. Probably shouldn't do this because uh, one time or another I was made feel this way. Like, just you know what I'm saying? Like, a, a, a woman doing this to another woman is it's just like, yeah, wow, guys. Look, we say this a lot before, and we'll, we'll wrap up this video with this. Like, look, everybody, everybody's unique, right? Everybody's a snowflake, everybody's unique. You're beautiful in the way that you are. I mean, there's literally like no, no one. No one should be able to say something to make you feel otherwise. And if they do, that's bad on them. That's not on you. Well, anyway, let us know your thoughts on this. Do you really feel like she was sorry or not? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, guys. See you. Later.